Hey skiers, I'm Jeff from SkiEssentials.com. Welcome to our 2023 ski test. Today we're gonna talk about the Armada Declivity 82 Ti. Um, this is really like the closest thing that Armada has ever made to a dedicated frontside ski. It's the narrowest ski in their all-mountain declivity line, home to very directional skis. You know, Armada's kind of known more for their twin tips, but the declivity skis are 100% directional all-mountain skis. Um, this one in particular is 82 underfoot, as is indicated in its name. Um, and it pretty much uses the same construction found in all the declivity skis. So a lightweight Karuba wood core, and then we get Armada's articulated titanal banding. So in that construction, on the top layer of metal, they actually cut these kind of longitudinal slits into the metal. That, as the name indicates, is allowing the ski to articulate or to twist a little bit in the tip or in the forebody of the ski. And what that's designed to do is basically just smooth out turn initiation. So as you're entering a turn, instead of the tip feeling really harsh and rigid, it feels more supple and smooth and kind of kind of really takes you and brings you into the turn. Um, despite using quite a bit of metal in these skis, because they've got that lighter core in there, they come in impressively at 1,650 grams, um, and this is the 174 centimeter length. So certainly not a tremendously heavy ski or anything like that. Um, you know, it does differ from a real dedicated front side ski in the sense that we do see Good amount of tip rocker up here, you know, nothing crazy, not like we're on a, an ARV 106 or something like that, but a little bit more of a gentle rise rather than the abrupt rise in a true front side ski. Little kick out of the tail there, but not too much tail rocker to speak of whatsoever. And there is a good amount of camber in this ski, really nice springy high rise camber. So it gives you a lot of pop and snap when you're finishing a turn. Um, Great ski, you know, I think this kind of class of skis gets overlooked a little bit. If you're not squarely in the front side category or if you're not in the kind of super popular around 90 category, um, skis can get a little bit lost, but there's a lot to like about skis like this. Carves turns really, really well, uh, holds an edge well, it's quick edge to edge, might not feel quite as just strong or, or as precise rather as kind of those dedicated carving skis that I was speaking to. But the benefit to that kind of the other side of the spectrum is that you get more versatility out of a ski like this. So this is, to be honest, one of my favorite mogul skis on the market right now. Um, quick, agile, it's pretty easy to get it to maneuver and kind of sniggle around. Um, it's got the stability that you need, but if you kind of stuff the tip into a mogul, it's not just going to like throw you on your butt. Um, there is a little bit of forgiveness and kind of user friendliness to it as well. I'd say pretty much always whenever we get a tester that's never skied this on this ski, they're pretty darn impressed and, and, and surprised by its performance. Not really what you think of when you think of Armada is edge-to-edge is -edge quickness and carving prowess, but this ski definitely has it. Um, so that's the Declivity 82 Ti from Armada. Let us know if you have any questions as usual. You can learn more about it on the site, um, and we'll see you guys out there on the slopes.